I was at the grocery store the other day, uh, and there was a liquor vendor sitting there giving out samples of eight different kinds of vodka. Yeah. I was like, really? Shops at Safeway now. Well, this is great. I'm bad enough when they go to the store stoned with all kinds of weird stuff. <laughs> Kitty litter, can of frosting. I don't have a cat. <laughs> or a cake. Uh, but <laughs> if I'm going to be drunk at the store, you know, I'm leaving with way more shady stuff. Uh, more booze, first of all. Uh, pizza, cigarettes, lottery tickets. Be screwed on Monday when I'm trying to make lunch. <laughs> you try making a sandwich out of two scratch tickets and a pack of camels. Right? Never mind the bag boy. I'll give him a ride home in the morning. <laughs> oh, just kidding. His mom will totally pick him up. <laughs> Uh, speaking of kids, you guys remember the Tooth Fairy? Yeah, that Tooth Fairy is like so weird that you know that kids don't even buy it. Like you won't even let the cleaning lady in your house without a nanny cam. You don't let some winged freak in your kid's bedroom looking for loose teeth. <laughs> Michelle all of a sudden decides she's a kidney fairy. Sorry, Johnny. Here's two bucks and a bag of ice. Uh, better look at those teeth next time, huh? <laughs> yeah. No, maybe I'm like not around kids enough anymore because uh, I live in San Francisco, but I would appreciate it if people would wait until their baby was at least 15 minutes old uh, and the goo has been squeegeed off uh, before sending me a picture. <laughs> I, this is a hospital situation, folks. I'm gonna send you a picture of my fresh appendix scar, like me on the operating table with a big jar of liposuction fat. I hope people say they're gonna sleep like a baby too. If you're gonna sleep like a baby, then don't call me because uh, all that means is you're gonna sleep for 16 hours, wake up screaming, crying with a full load, and then puke all over yourself. <laughs> Just like my college roommate. <laughs>